hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're a first timer hi my name is imadi so today i have a very 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 important guest a very beautiful talented in fact any 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 good characteristics you want to add to that in, in our list today and she's going to be introducing herself she's going to be part of today's conversation and her name is stephanie <laughs> So, guys, meet Stephanie. Stephanie, meet them. Hi. <laughs> okay. so, she's Stephanie, and today she's going to be joining us on our conversation. Today, we're going to be talking about friendship. Friendship, mm -hmm. toxic friends, mm -hmm. toxic friendship, relationships, oh, juicy, juicy, you know, juicy. Everything <laughs> you need to know about that. That's what we're going to be talking about today. Friendship breakups mm -hmm. are more extreme, like they're painful. It's very extreme because you can imagine your friend. Like, okay, there was this when I go into high school, I went with my friend and um, we went to school and we had this whole oh, we'll work together, we'll do this together, we'll go to class together and all of a sudden ah, me, Sha, <laughs> I went to school and then I feel I was the one that started the whole drifting away from the friendship thingy mm -hmm. and um, I got carried away in a way because I said it's like new people and fine girl, fine girl um she's pet seeds oh i want my school daughter you guys know the school daughter rubbish <laughs> i want to my school daughter i want to be my my friend or something and then i lost track of my like i just left my friend behind and so she also yeah, anyway anyway <laughs> i i she also made new friends but it hurts me because why are you making new friends? I feel like you should be there. Like, okay. You should wait for me oh, like to, to finish what I'm doing at home. To be done whatever I'm doing. And then she'd come and just me about her friend. I was hurt. I was really hurt that period. I've not really had a serious friendship breakup. Like, oh, I'm not. Uh, although I've had it with guys, but the difference with guys is that it doesn't hurt that much. Like, your Charlie, friends, like Charlie your Charlie. girlfriends. But just imagine, okay, I've shared secrets with you, mm -hmm. and then we now stop talking. Then you're not scared. Should be ah. thinking. <laughs> we are just. What's if? We are the gist of what's, if, what's if? What's if? Well, that's where people should know that if somebody tells you something, whether you guys are in good terms or you are not in good terms, you're not going to share your mouth. Like shut up. But the thing is, guy friendship and breaking up with whatever that is. That most times, <clears throat> why the relationship usually used to break, it's not really like a quarrel. It's either maybe you not find out that the person likes you, or maybe you're not reciprocating, or maybe they try to do yeah, something for me. Exactly. Then you guys will not no longer be friends. So that one doesn't really used to touch you. Just be like, wow. Or well, even if you were so, in a serious relationship with anybody, and at some point you just say, okay, this is not going to work. I feel like it's just a guy and you just have the, the mindset that oh, I'm going to meet somebody better. Mm. I'm talking about myself, maybe. I don't know about that, but I just have the mindset that, oh, I'm going to meet somebody better. I don't That's need to like force her. But me losing my friends, like this was the person I used to like go to, like your go to person. Tell guys, this is what somebody's doing to me. If I don't have, like, I don't know, but it's. I should fuck her in the best. Yeah. 